stop watching these stupid videos. Stop making this dumbass viral. And uh, since you're all here and engaged in this sort of inquiry and listening to this sort of lecture, I assume that you're all on the process of waking up. Or else you're teasing yourselves with some kind of uh, flirtation with waking up. Hey guys, everyone's favorite poser here. Come on, we're gonna take a trip to the biggest and bestest poser skate shop there is. Come on. I just had to make sure my bearings worked. We are going to go to the best poser skate shop that there is, you guys. Now, this is a chain skate shop. Um, this matters, this is relevant. If you shop here, you are not a real skateboarder. And here's why, I'm gonna show you why. We're gonna go into Zoomies and we are going to, I already said all this, right? Let's walk. All right, we're getting closer. I'm pretty nervous, I'm already shaking. My hands are shaking really, really bad. Why is that? I'm really nervous because, you know, if anyone sees me in here, I'm gonna lose all cre 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 credibility as a core skater. Oh. And you know what that means. If you're not, if you do not have your core street credibility as a core skater, you go to skate parks and you get this kind of look. It's funny because earlier you were saying how nervous you were of what they're gonna think of you. You were saying you want the employees to be impressed with you. Mm, oh, don't, oh, don't, sorry, don't sorry, sorry, sorry. So anyway, anyway, coreness, appeal, aesthetic, it's all important. Currently looking at the definition of cornice. Not a word. Right, right, it's not at all. Was that VR? Doesn't matter. Poser, corn. Shop local. That's it, you guys, that's it. We're, we're really close, I'm really nervous. The employees that work in there, they know everything. The shoes and the boards that are in there, they're the best. Don't shop local, okay? Stop, stop. You can locally farm, you can do all this, you can do all that. No, dude, no, 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 none of that. That's garbage. That's what I'm trying Go to, to say. Go to Zoomies. That's what I'm trying to say. Realistically, you're not gonna get the cheapest product for the cheapest price because they have skateboarding's best interest. They really do. Right. What's an industry without money? That's what this is all about. I mean, skateboarding, it's fun, yeah, it's fun, but I mean, if you really look, if you really look, if you really take a good look at how many millionaire, billionaire, because there's so many that make so much money. It's, it's crazy. True. If you want to make a lot of money, get into skate. And I know people will say like, dude, it's not about the money, but we know at the end of the day, if you're not throwing money at people with less money and burning it and setting it on fire in front of them, you're not doing your job That's right. That's true. By the way, quick ad real quick. <laughs> this will be in the new March line. This is a new slamming shirt. Hopefully, eventually, you'll be able to get this at Zoomies. <laughs> Plug, money. Property prestige. All right, so we gotta be very quiet going in here. We gotta be really stealthy with the camera because if they tell me not to film, you know what I'm gonna say? F that. Hey, try to be as quiet as possible, okay? Right, right, right. What's up, we here? All your favorite Instagram skaters, they all wear these. You know what those are called? Roth Book bags? Rothko. Rothko. Is that what that is? Yeah, it's called Rothko. That camo? That's yeah, called Rothko. Rothko? Rothko. Hey, Versace plug shoes. They don't carry dunks. You know why? Because, because they're core. Because there's so many stupid core skate shops that are so bitter about the fact that Zoomies makes more money than them. They all just... It teases me off, dude. Brands have like a separate coreness opportunity that they can give their riders, but Zoomies can't carry that opportunist. So they have these. These are all of the, you know, the best brand. Right, the Nike is brand. the most core. Most core brand. That's right. Fair. They started skateboarding. They're in it for the local scene. These guys started it. They did. Brands like this, you know? Yeah, what is this? Don't support the smaller brands. Oh my because god. Oh, look at this one too. Ba Ew. Basically what I'm basically what that I'm Nike trying to say. That Nike check is wrong, dude. Yeah, it's a they, they messed up. Basically what I'm trying to say is, is you can't support these smaller brands simply because they Right. These aren't that cool. You gotta buy what's cool because if you're not mm -hmm. what's cool, you're not gonna make a lot of money and you're not gonna be sick and the kids are gonna bully you at school and you're not gonna get laid or get or whatever. What's that? Those things people put their 
too, dude. Don't be discriminatory. They put the stuff in there, you know? Like, yeah. It's like, yeah, okay. Yes. So, they poop in diapers. My point is, is you can't wear stuff like this and expect to get the poo nanny. And this was started by skaters who so definitely don't support that. Right, yeah. Oh, gosh. These dude, were started by people who don't have those ever Those were started skated. by people who are very money minded and they know how to make money. Skaters, we don't know how to do anything. Exactly. Don't oh, give us I don't money. mean we. I don't mean we. I meant like other people besides me and you. I was about to kick your ass. Yeah, because we know what we're doing. No, that's a skate brand if I've ever seen one. It actually is. What is it? Madam. <laughs> is that a Halsey shirt? That's skateboarding. I've ever seen skateboarding. Let's let's take a look at their shop while they're back because they got the best, highest quality hologram graphics. This place is really just taking it above and beyond. They're really doing things that no one else is doing. Dude, they carry shirts. Uh huh. Yeah. My shop doesn't do that. Really, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> Oh my god, I hate myself. You don't go into a skate shop and if you don't see posters, that wasn't even a sentence. If you go into a skate shop and you don't see posters, walk the f out. Some of my favorite brands, Decline, iPath, Marvel. <laughs> Some of the most still in business brands. <laughs> This is why a big retail chain is better than a normal skate shop. Normal skate shops don't carry eats. You gotta, you gotta really, like, evaluate your customer base, your customer fan base, and then... And uh, since you're all here, and engaged in this sort of inquiry, and listening to this sort of lecture, I assume that you're all on the process of waking up. Or else you're teasing yourselves with some kind of uh, flirtation with waking up. <laughs> maybe skaters won't use this, but right. Walmart will use it. Right. Like maybe some kid's gonna come in and he's gonna be like, I want a penny board, but not the type that people do 900s on. We don't do 900s in no. my house. And his mom was even like, we don't do 900s in my house. No. You can't get this at a normal skate shop. You just can't. They have exclusive things here you can't get anywhere. You can try, but it's not a good skate shop, right? Right. Oh, oh, oh another, oh, I just found something even more core. What? This is another thing. Okay, so this, those are like this. They're just longer. It's crazy. They don't have the fast spinning wheel long boards that you would think that they, that they, that they, that they do at the core skate shops like they do here. Because I mean, look how fast these wheels spin. Where's the electric ones? Let's come back and then, all right, let's come back and okay. we'll make sure it's still spinning. Gotcha, okay. All right, we're back. Three hours later. Still spinning. It just stopped. Still spinning. Three hours later. Now that we're down in the corner where the core, okay, so like this is the corner. Right. Sick, the dude. Cor Sick. The corner. This is the core section of the, the, the skate shop. This is a skate shop, right? right. We call it that, right? right? It's just a higher end one. Yeah, I mean, it's better than a skate shop, so what do you call that? Have your core branded wax. You can't get this anywhere else. I will, I, okay, sorry, I lied there. I'm just trying to exaggerate to make the video a little better. <laughs> you can actually get this at core skate shops, but one thing you can't get at core skate shops. Yo, yo. He's up too much. This dude right on you. These aren't even, they're not even words. Would a poser be able to tell you that? No. Go into a core skate shop, you're gonna be dealing with a bunch of posers. Headwear is very, very crucial in skateboarding. Okay, so I've always said skateboarding is about three things. Shoes, pants, and headwear. Best of the best. Obey right. propaganda. That means like, obey your mother and obey your older skateboarders because if they're telling you're you that you're a poser, just them. They don't Yo, know what they're talking uh, about. Do what you're told. Sit down, shut your mouth, do what you're told. I was trying to be like a womanizer, like sit down, oh. shut up, do what you're told. Ripping it made of a This is quality product, right? Okay, death world, right? Okay, it's got the perfectness of edgy, but it also has your like Orange County beer psychedelic rock vibe to it. My favorite genre of music. By putting death in the font and the hat, you you appear to a more edgy crowd and the kids are like, oh, that's cool, I love Baja. Take the culture of the underprivileged and you sell it to the richer kids. This is saying foo, but really, if you look at it closer, you notice that it says F you. And if you look at it even closer and you analyze it a little better, it's saying F you. It's the university I went to, bro. You Guarantee know, a white guy made that. I'm not gonna see this at a normal skate shop. People at normal skate shops can't read this because they're uneducated. What's the title of this video? Where have I taken this? Poser Zoomies. Poser <laughs> Zoomies. <laughs> Thrasher. Poser, zoomies. <laughs> this hoodie I'm zooming into. <laughs> Realistically, I mean, when you start skating, that's when you're fully immersed in skating. That's when you actually know everything. It's kind of like when you're born. Like, they talk about the idea of being born, and you're coming straight from the source when you're born. So, like, that means- It's more like being born again. That means you're closest to, like, whatever the source was. So, like, being a poser, it's the same kind of ideology. Oh my God. 
You're closest to the idea and prophecy of what skateboarding is and has to become. Now, why posers shop at Zoomies? This is why posers know what's up. So like, you know, don't go to schools and call your kids posers because they're just like, they know more than you. <laughs> don't go to school and call your kids posers. <laughs> That'd be the meanest thing if a parent did that. Chill. Nice. It's lit. Family squad. <laughs> Can't read. If you want skateboarding to grow, you gotta just exploit the culture. You gotta exploit it, you gotta make all the money, you gotta put Thrasher in the best of skate shops here. And you gotta make sure you're appealing to all the edgy kids at high school that don't skate. Wish they could, but they don't and they won't. But they listen to like... And they're rich, but they'll buy the poor clothes. System of a doubt. Well, not the hottest fire of Instagram edits right now is trap. And what is a trap? It's like when, it's like when you have try to trap you. And she wraps her leg. Say what's up. Yeah, right when you're about to knock on the door and be like, hey, what's up, let me in. She's like, oh, you're gonna come in and you're not going anywhere, so you're staying with me. But this also refers to a trap house where they Music came from that and just made a really hard, edgy essence around the community. It's really relatable. My mom took Percocet because she was really rich. <laughs> Culture, poser, thrasher, Jake Phelps, what's up? Leave a comment below. I went to the doctor once, I broke my arm, and the doctor was like, yo, when you get home, just put some ice on it. I came here. Flex, go to school, flex. Homecoming, prom, in and out date night. If you don't live in California, Burger King, that's fine too. Maybe Taco Bell, whatever, wherever you're gonna I go. I feel like Apple you don't make that much money though. Oh, parents, oh, never mind, I forgot. I, right. I forgot. Parents, parents got the money. I think, dude. Stupid, dude, sorry. Dude. I have not said or explained anything. <laughs> I've just wasted 13 minutes of somebody's <laughs> life.